Hi, I'm Joy, and today I want to show you how to integrate square root of x squared minus 1. First, you set x equals to secant theta, then you derivative both sides dx equals to secant theta tangent theta d theta. Then you put secant theta to x and secant theta tangent theta d theta to dx. Here, secant squared theta minus 1 equals to tangent squared theta and then you can cancel your square root which is tangent theta and rewrite it here the same thing now you have two tangent you can combine them to tangent squared theta this one cancel so tangent squared theta again is the same as secant squared theta minus 1. So I rewrite it to secant squared theta minus 1 times secant theta. Here. You distribute to secant cubed minus secant theta d theta. For this one, you can check out description on how to integral secant cubed theta. And what we got is a half secant theta tangent theta plus a half ln secant theta plus tangent theta. For integral of secant theta, you can check out notes here. That would be ln secant theta plus tangent theta. That's the same as this one, but that's a half. That's minus one. So that will become minus a half like this one. And the, this one, you just rewrite it here. Now we set secant theta equals to x the same as this one, but x you can think it as x over 1, then you graph it, triangle, you can look at it and you can find out tangent theta is square root of x squared minus 1 over 1. And just rewrite it here, second theta is what we said x, and tangent theta is square root of x squared minus 1. Here. That's the same. You put secant in, tangent in, and that's the answer. Our answer is here. Don't forget to plus C. Okay. Thank you. <laughs>